Hola, and welcome once again to the Schaefer two-car garage and small engine shop. Today, we've got a little bit of a rarity on the bench, and I'll show it to you. How many people have ever seen a snapper chainsaw? S 1838. Interesting part number. It does have an 18 inch bar, but it's got a 42 cc engine in it. And it's a first cousin to my 4218 new Poland chainsaw. But this is a 2003 model that my friend Bob told me was a one year production model in Walmart decided that they were going to save snapper. And they put in snapper chainsaws, snapper blowers, snapper string trimmers, all of which Poland Weed Eater here in Shreveport made. And they put in even Poland's snappers, famous rear engine riding mowers. Uh, however, it was not enough to save snapper and Briggs and Stratton ended up with the Stripper, the Snapper brand, and the brand is still alive, but it's basically, uh, I think, some walk-behind mowers that MTD or somebody makes, and a pretty decent line of uh, skid steer or uh, uh, zero-turn mowers that uh, I believe Briggs makes in the Ferris plant up in New York. But we'll take a look at this chainsaw and then we'll give it a tug and see what it does. Well, Mr. Snapper here used to be Snapping Turtle back when they first got started. We'll pull this housing off and I need to put the air filter and stuff back on it. But you can see it's a very modern design, uh, vertical cylinder. And I can tell you, if it's not a clone of my current 10 year old 4218, it'll do till a, a clone comes along. Nice Warburg car, uh, one of the uh, simple designs, not the uh, Stratocharge. And my 4218 is Stratocharge. This, this is a just a simple car, but it's got a remote primer on it. And uh, good looking saw, great looking plastics. And uh, don't know how many of these uh, Poland sold, but. It's, it's here, and this one's in very good shape. It's like a lot of Polands, uh, they slobber oil, uh, which I like when they're being operated, cutting wood, I like them to slobber oil. But on the other hand, you put them in the case and uh, they're gonna fill the case up with slobbered oil. But it's a nice saw. Uh, I'll put it back together and we'll give it a tug here and see what she does. All right, here goes nothing. We had to come out here. Mrs. Small Engine Shop is working on a painting project kind of by the uh, Small Engine Shop and Two Car Garage. And she uh, takes umbrage when I run these chainsaws in the garage and she's right there two feet away. So we'll come out here to the outdoor t wash stand and This is one of the main things I have to do to every piece of equipment that comes in here. They're all filthy and I have to degrease them, use various brushes to get them all clean. I hate working on filthy stuff. But here we go. Mission on, choke on, here we go. 
Let's do that. get that carb tuned where it'll take throttle, work on that low screw a little bit, and she'll go back to her owner. Hope this helps somebody and you find it interesting. Thanks for watching.